Welcome, Namaste, and welcome to Dr. Shah's clinic. In this video, we are going to answer a very important clinical question. And the question is Does varicocele surgery improve sperm motility? Now, in my last video, we had answered the question Does varicocele surgery improve sperm concentration? The answer to that was no. Does varicocele surgery improve fertility? The answer to that also is no. And in this video, I'm going to answer the question Does varicocele surgery improve sperm motility? The answer to that is again a big no. And let me tell you why. Now, a large number of normal men also have varicoceles. So, about 15 to 20% or maybe even up to 30% of men, if you select them randomly from the population and do an ultrasound scan, you would de detect subclinical varicocele or grade 1 or grade 2 varicoceles. Now, should you operate on all these patients? The answer is definitely no. A fertility procedure is not indicated in many cases. And especially with respect to varicocelectomy, which is the surgery used to correct the varicocele, the UK NICE guidelines in 2013 made it very, very clear that please do not you know, advocate this particular procedure for patients who are seeking fertility therapies because point number one, even though there may be some improvement in sperm motility, which, is, which could be a very minor improvement and we would not even know whether the procedure caused the improvement, there is absolutely no increment in terms of pregnancy rate. Ultimately, when a patient is seeking you know, a specific fertility treatment or fertility therapy, the objective is to ensure that the patient takes a baby home. The idea is to, the take home baby rates or the pregnancy rates, you know, are what are actually more important. So just because a patient, you know, notices an improvement in the sperm concentration or motility, say about 8% or 9% or 10%, that, that does not actually guarantee that that patient will father a child. So as far as varicoceles are concerned, large scale studies have been conducted uh, with respect to you know correcting the varicocele surgeries and you know research into you know actually whether uh, research into varicocele surgeries you know have been done and what they have found is uh, there was a large meta-analysis published in the European um, European Urology Journal it was in the year 2011 if I'm right and in this particular study what they had found was a varicocele correction actually results in an improvement in sperm motility for about just 9.69 percent which is a very very small number because the other thing to bear in mind is, there was first of all the study reported no improvement in terms of pregnancy rate. Second, the small improvement of nine percent is very very you know insignificant. Why? Because if you do if you take a single healthy individual, and if you do a repeat semen analysis for the same healthy individual multiple times, you would see a ten to twenty percent variation in motility as well as sperm concentration for the same individuals between different reports. So, was it the varicocele surgery? that you know led to the 9% change or improvement in sperm motility or was it a natural variation which are usually not accounted for. So that's the main important that's the main thing that's actually going against varicocele surgery. So the UK NICE guidelines have made it very clear not to do the surgery. Even in my clinical experience what I have seen is for many patients who are quite healthy they have good semen parameters before the procedure and after they do the procedure what eventually happens is their sperm motility actually goes down some individuals even their concentration goes down there's a deterioration of semen parameters after the varicocele surgery so should a varicocele surgery be done to improve uh, sperm motility and sperm concentration the answer is a big no please please refrain from doing any type of varicocele surgeries I'm a strong advocate of this. I personally believe, even my personal experience, the science, the data, it's all very, very clear. There are much better fertility therapies that you can actually take. Therapies like IUI, kind of trying naturally, timed intercourse, lifestyle modifications, healthy food habits. These are all very, very simple treatment strategies that work even better than all these varicocele you know, related procedures. So stay safe and um, what's very important is please like, comment and subscribe, share this video with your friends and loved ones. Remember to take a second opinion if you have been diagnosed with a varicocele. I'll be happy to help you out. This is Dr. Shah. I'll see you soon with another video.